Hey guys, so in a previous video, we set up the app protection policies and we enrolled an iPad device and we uh, also uh, added the email account of the user to the iPad in Outlook and now in this video, I'm going to show you how to basically delete only corporate data from this device and not touch the user's uh, personal data and this way we're only basically not touching what they have, we're touching the corporate data only and we're deleting. So uh, I'm gonna show you the iPad I have. So this is the iPad and as you can see, I have Outlook. And it does have its emails in it. And let me make it a little bit bigger here. So I have my email, this is the corporate emails basically. And now we want to go and issue a command to delete this email. Now, remember, if the user has their own personal email on Outlook, it's not going to be touched. Only this email will be touched. So let's get to it and see how it's done. So the first thing we need to do is to go to Endpoint Manager, endpoint.microsoft.com, and then go to Apps, and then App Selective Wipe. We're going to create a wipe request. Select the user. The user we uh, did this demo on was uh, B3, this guy. And he's the one that has the email. This is the iPad that we registered. So I'm going to create this. This uh, wipe. And now when we go to the iPad, we're going to take a look at it. It's going to take some time, but I'm going to take the uh, look at the uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pause for maybe uh, 15 minutes or so or half hour. And then I'm going to open Outlook in front of you and see how everything happens. So I think I waited enough time. I'm going to go ahead and open my Outlook again and see what happens now. And as you can see, it's saying checking your organization data access requirement for this app. And basically, it's going to go ahead and delete it. Your organization has removed its data associated with this app to connect to your organization. And that's it. Basically, now Outlook no longer has the email. So Outlook no longer has the corporate email, but if there was an, a personal email in there, it'll stay there. And with that, basically, we uh, wipe anything related to corporate and we keep the personal uh, data for end users. Uh, well, that concludes this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and have a good day.